Hello everyone, Tommy with Studio Sense here. Thanks so much for stopping by to check out today's video. You know, back in 1984, there was a movie that was released called The Wildlife. In this movie, there was a character that was a high school student, and the movie made this character say multiple times, It's casual, it's casual, it's casual, in the hopes that they would create a new trend. While casual may not catch on as this tremendous catchphrase, it is a very important word because it's really part of a lifestyle, not only in terms of fashion and many other industries, but also in men's fragrance as well. Well, I want to feature 10 fragrances that are extremely cheap, but absolutely perfect for t-shirt and jeans combination. One of the most popular ensembles for the casual lifestyle. Got that and more coming your way, so stay tuned. Welcome back all my casual friends and bros out there. I really enjoy the laid back style of certain fragrances and I'm excited to feature these 10 casual colognes that are perfect for that classic ensemble of t-shirt and jeans or really any outfit that's a favorite comfortable outfit of yours. And these casual colognes are extremely cheap, very inexpensive, very affordable. In most cases, they're gonna be under 30 bucks. The first casual cologne that's really inexpensive, super affordable, is actually by Juicy Couture. It's called Dirty English. I really like Dirty English because it's a very lightly boozy, leather-oriented fragrance. So if you like lightly boozy fragrances that have kind of a dirty leather feel to them, you'll really enjoy Dirty English. It's appropriately named. Black leather, sandalwood, ebony, so darker wood as well as amber. Very well put together fragrance. For the most part, users highly rate this one, and it's one of those hidden gems because you don't hear anybody talking about. Juicy Couture, of course, is better known for their female fragrances, but they make a pretty good men's leather dark leather fragrance as well and that's why i recommend dirty english for a great casual cologne you can get this for under 30 bucks about 28 bucks speaking of the 80s back in 1985 perry ellis created a men's fragrance it's a cologne it was perry ellis for men cologne that's not the one that i'm talking about right now i think later on in 2008 they reformulated and re-released perry ellis for men one of the best t-shirt and jeans fragrances especially if you like the note of apple and leather together because that's the best duo in this fragrance that combination along with that green apple and leather you've got woody notes you've got some musk that adds a little bit of weight but by and large it's a fruity lightly textured because of that leather woody fragrance that's great for the casual corner uh, this one you can get a 100 ml bottle for under 30 bucks usually around 25 26. back in the heyday of malls there was a store that i would go to where i would buy my jeans and usually get my fragrance there as well because all the girls that were saleswomen there were beautiful and they worked on commission and the fragrance that they sold me on was True Religion Drifter. True Religion's Drifter is definitely the kind of fragrance made for t-shirt and jeans, or really any casual setting, any casual situation. It's got ginger, cardamom, grapefruit, blackberry, and pear, so it opens up with this lightly fruity, lightly sweet, but very masculine fragrance. It segues into a spicy rosemary and juniper in the heart, but there's also a bit of apricot and some other fruits too. So it's kind of a, you don't get that very fruitful sense. It's just, it doesn't really come across as a fruity fragrance. It comes across more like Perry Ellis for Men, like a lightly textured leather, fruit and leather fragrance. It's got a little bit of vetiver, some guaiac wood, sandal wood as the woods. Unlike Drifter, which is somebody walking around without a plan or without a sense of direction, this fragrance definitely has a direction and it's wholly casual and it's really an overall great everyday wear. Performs really good for the price and you can get a 100 ml bottle for right around 30 bucks. Another great casual fragrance for the ensemble of t-shirt and jeans is a fragrance by Lacoste. It's the original Lacoste Poron. I really enjoy this fragrance because it's got something for everyone. You've got a fruity opening of grapefruit, plum, and apple. You've got juniper, cardamom, pink pepper, and cinnamon in the heart. But the base is rum, sandalwood, cedar, and vanilla. Again, this is one of those fragrances that when you smell it, it's got a bit of a retro 90s feel to it, but it's not done in a dated way. It doesn't smell cheap. It doesn't smell old because of the lightly boozy, fruity overall formula. This is a great performing fragrance. It came out in like 2000. A lot of people still enjoy it, but it's one of those that's easy to forget, but it's a great everyday 
casual wear quick grab. Lacoste Porom. Another great casual quick grab from a designer that's well known for creating them, especially like vacation type fragrances, is Tommy Bahama For Him. This is pretty much a fruity, ginger, violet leaf, amber, tonka, sandalwood lightly sweet very creamy fragrance but it also has kind of a boozy effect there's no rum or no booze in this but you would swear that there's a little bit of a rum or light cognac because it does come across in the dry down and i think that's a nod towards a decently blended formula tommy bahama for him carries similar qualities as the maritime line in fact maritime triumph is also a really good cheap fragrance similar to this one and i'll leave a link below for that one because that's a new fragrance for 2021 and i really enjoy that one because it's got a bit of cashmere in to balance that whole aquatic fruit overall everyday wear fragrance as opposed to strictly aquatic and that's kind of the same thing that tommy bahama for him is doing another great casual pick that's super cheap you can get a 100 ml bottle for about 22 bucks now i couldn't create a cheapy list of casual colognes for that epic ensemble of t-shirt and jeans without including the wonderful aquatic Nautica Voyage. Nautica Voyage is, of course, it's been in many, many lists. It's been in lists on my channel before, although not a ton, but it just goes, it pairs so well with t-shirt and jeans. Sure, it's slightly synthetic, but that's why it lasts for so long. Uh, let's face it, any fragrance that has zambroxan or aquatic notes in it that are aroma chemical are gonna, it's gonna last for a decent amount of time. Uh, this performs eight plus hours. It does have green leaves, apple mimosa. It's got marine notes in the heart coming across very aquatic. Cedarwood, musk, and amber to round out a fantastic casual cologne formula. Nautica Voyage is super cheap too. You can pretty much find it anywhere for under 20 bucks and most places discounters will have it on clearance. So look for this to probably be discontinued at some point in the future, but right now grab it up while you can. Another great casual cologne that was made by guests and specifically was made for the casual situation and the casual ensemble of t-shirt and jeans. In fact, the actual box that it comes in is faux jean material around it is guess 1981 indigo when you smell 1981 indigo you get this sense of a bookend or the encapsulation of what makes being casually comfortable so intriguing you know and such a great part of, of a lifestyle this comes across in a lightly spicy fig coconut kind of way it feels like a little bit of a vacation fragrance with that coconut but the fig mellows it out it has roasted tonka bean cedar wood amber and something called silkalide that gives it this kind of i don't know it's almost like a retro feel that's really what makes 1981 indigo a classic casual cologne now this one you can get a 100 ml bottle for sure for under 20 bucks guess 1981 indigo similar to other designer houses whose focus is on releasing cheap options for men kenneth cole has released quite a few fragrances that are a bit watered down you know they're they're like derivations of popular fragrances but nothing new, nothing exciting, with a few exceptions, and I believe this is an exception. It's from the Mankind line, which given as a whole is a really good line. It's Mankind Legacy. Mankind Legacy is definitely the fruitiest of the line. This one is, I feel like, one of the more versatile and youthful oriented fragrances in the Mankind line. It's got Clary Sage, Mandarin Orange, Fir Balsam, Amorous. It's got Sandalwood, Cedar, Patchouli. It's just, while the formula itself isn't going to be something that's going to knock your socks off, it's a very solid performing fragrance that is one of the more pleasant to wear and to smell and to share with others. It's definitely a crowd pleasing fragrance and stands out as really one of the better quick grabs in the casual cologne genre. Right now you can get Mankind Legacy for around 26 bucks at fragrancenet.com. Last year Alfred Dunhill released the Eau de Parfum Dunhill Driven, which is really nice soft floral apple oriented fragrance. It's not the best casual fragrance, but you can definitely wear it casually. However, they did release the EDT or Eau de Toilette version of Dunhill Driven, and that one I think is a pretty dramatic improvement over the EDP. It still carries that overall apple oriented fougere aroma, but it makes better use of juniper, orange blossom, teak wood, vetiver, and that modern aroma chemical ambroxan and with that good bit of ambroxan in there but it's, it's not enough for it to be kind of heavy or scratchy or too synthetic feeling it works in the same way as peppers and ginger and other fragrant notes that work to push forward to synergize the other 
primary notes so that it's more aromatic, you know, gives it more projection. Dunhill Driven, the EDT smells better, is an improvement in the performance because that's one thing the EDP suffered. Even though the concentration of oils are better in the EDP, the EDT actually lasts a bit longer because of how well it's blended and the addition of Ambroxan. Right now you can get it at fragrancex.com for about 25 bucks for a 100 ml bottle, which I believe is about the cheapest you can find it. Dunhill Driven, the EDT. All right, guys, last of the 10 casual colognes that pair perfectly with the t-shirt and jeans ensemble is a fragrance by Azaro. In fact, when I think of this fragrance, it automatically reminds me of my favorite crisp, white, clean t-shirt, and that is Azaro Chrome Pure. Chrome Pure, just like the name, just like the bottle, it's epically fresh and clean and fruity, it also happens to be an oriental fragrance. Oriental because of the combination of notes, but it doesn't come across as heavy or smoky or weighted. In fact, out of all of the chrome flankers, this is one of my favorite in terms of everyday wear and signature scent. The fruit of mandarin orange, bergamot, and orange blossom dominate the open, moving into a woody heart of Akigala wood, pepper wood, and atlas cedar. So you've got three kinds of woods infused into the heart of the fragrance and that's really where it gets its power from. Base has a good bit of tonka bean which gives it its creamy sweetness and musk but it also is a great projecting fragrance. Again it's one of my favorite chrome fragrances out of all of the flankers just because of the way that it performs. Really inexpensive too it's usually right around 40 or just under 40 bucks especially at uh, fragrancenet.com right now. I think you can get it as a tester which is a really good price. Sometimes it does come with Without the lid. Presentation is important, but if you're saving money, then it's really all about the smell. Definitely check out Chrome Pure. If you don't want to go with Chrome Pure, Chrome Aqua is also a great find, a great gem by Azaro. Guys, that is it for my 10 super cheap casual colognes. These pair perfectly and you're not going to spend a lot of money. If you own any of the fragrances that we talked about in this list today or have experience with them or have worn them, let me know what your thoughts are on them. Or if you feel like there are other fragrances that are super cheap that fit perfectly for that casual scenario, that casual situation, or that classic ensemble of t-shirt and jeans, let us know what those are as well in the comments below. Thanks so much though guys for taking time out of your day to check out today's video. As always, thank you so much for your support on my channel. I'm Tommy with Studio Sense and I'll see you tomorrow.